uh, preseason, um, we've been practicing as much as we can. Uh, we got the conference championship uh, starting a little earlier as, as usual this year. So we really don't have a lot of time to get the kids prepped and ready, but they've been swinging all summer. Um, been in a couple of tournaments, some of them, and uh, so far they're looking pretty good. And if we can uh, continue with the good weather, I think the scores will be pretty low for us. This year, I'm really looking for us as a collective team to do well at Skylines. We did well when we hosted last year, but since we're going to Farmingdale, definitely want to um, make our presence known. I want to do well collectively. I mean, we only got five guys, but we're five good guys, so I do believe we can definitely put up some good numbers, even though we're at a number disadvantage. So I think as a team, we have high expectations. We had a pretty good season in the spring. We lost some guys, but we have some new people on the team, and we're excited to see how we do together. Uh, expectations, we're trying to win a lot of matches, maybe uh, definitely try to win the Skyline this year, and we've got a couple new guys on the team, we're really looking forward to it. It's been really nice getting to know all these guys, making some new uh, connections, having fun playing golf. And uh, my goals for this year, uh, improve my game, hopefully the team, as a team we can do well in Skyline, and just have a great season overall. We have uh, Joe as a junior, Joe Tantillo, he's, uh, he's been swinging well all last year and right through the summer. Um, I anticipate him definitely being part of the conference team, all conference team, and uh, still being number one and uh, team captain this year. Uh, we have uh, returner Pat Dyson Dew from Smithtown. He's getting his game in, he's got some new irons, got some new equipment. He's been working on some, some stu stuff over the summer. Uh, he's pretty confident going into the season. I got Justin Conroy, he's a, he's a returner, and um, Justin's been swinging a lot all, all summer, so uh, he's going to do really well for us in that third position. I got two new freshmen in. I got Ryan Caton from Dix Hills. He's been playing really well over the summer. He's a very, very good young man. He works hard at his game. He, come, he practices a lot at Beth Page. He's been um, kind of a, a, one of my no, number one recruits coming in, and uh, followed, uh, followed by um, Connor Conzone, who's from Smithtown, and uh, he's our, he'll be our number five guy. He's got a little bit of game to work on, but we're going to work with him, and we're going to get him going for the season. Well, I'm pretty confident that we're going to be uh, we're going to be we're going to be contenders this year. Um, I don't want to do any less than third place in our conference. Um, I would think that uh, Ryan should make uh, all conference or a basically a freshman of the year. I have, I'm very confident with him, and. Uh, Joe Tantillo, All Conference, Pat, All Conference.